So now it's recording. The laptop is recording. Six, I didn't put it on. So now that's going, and I'm waiting to be invited in at um, eight o'clock, which is in fifteen minutes, by um, Jamie Napolo, and hopefully um, James K will be on with him. But anyway, I'm going to talk tonight. To James, uh, to uh, um, uh, Jamie Nuttall, and talk about the crypto and the videos that I watch of it, and learn what he's going to say about it, and how it's going to fit into our new startup business there. That I want him to guide it, the Moai Powerhouse Group Limited Company, and restart it from brand new. Okay. So there, that's been dormant for a long time. I never got it going because I never raised the money uh, from the tidal turbine project in Scotland. I entered the um, competition here in New Zealand and was one of the best projects, um, but uh, Crest Energy and Kaipara won the money, um, four million, and I missed out because I didn't have the money to pay up front to go in and had the best idea that the people there in the Kaipara wanted and Napu wanted as well. So that plan is still there, no one's built it yet. So I can go straight ahead with the credit and the, um, the um, asset value of the 17 trillion uh, US dollar value of uh, stolen money by Eddie Mitchell, director of his company Mitchell Family Trust debtor, okay? Judgment default debtor, and we've got a credit against that, a letter of credit against that mortgage on his head and his trust and all 303 registered companies in Australia with 17 trillion US dollars spent on real estate in all different um, uh, districts and cities in Australia. Okay, so that when we're going to talk about the tax mainly and how to set up our company there under his guidance and under James K's guidance and the crypto we're going to go with. I've got Bitcoin already and uh, uh, we could go with that or go with Coinly and their crypto or we'll go with um, another one if we think so. So there, there's several things I want to talk about. The best method and the cleanest method so we have a good profile and I've got a good business profile behind me with the hydrogen um, turbine project, hydrogen economy. Gin economy. Economy. And I wanted to put the tidal turbine bridge up in um, um, the uh, um, White Cliffs of Dover at, um, uh, to France across in the waters there in, in um, England and um, join to um, a project here on East Cape and fly straight from there to East Cape on hydrogen. Bulk hydrogen mass uh, mass production, <coughs> okay, in the sea, tidal turbine hydraulic power. The power is at the bottom of the ocean, not the top, not floating on the top. It's all torque power <coughs> in the roughest seas out of shipping lanes, okay. So that's that, and uh, that whoops, something's turned off. Hang on, the video's turned off. So that's recording now. Okay, that's going now. We'll leave that there. That's going. I'll do that like that. So that won't fall over. There. That's right there. And then I'll just wait for Jamie to bring me on. <coughs> and the laptop is recording. Yes, so we've got um, two minutes to go. We've 
got two minutes to go before Jamie brings me on on his Zoom uh, meeting. Um, I don't know how long he'll be going for. He'll probably have a, a, a longer than 30 minutes. My Zooms are 30 minutes. That's all. It's uh, free. Uh, and then anything after that you have to pay for. So that's my Zoom meetings are short to set up um, a, a, a one to one with someone in Britain. I don't want to talk anywhere else in the world, but just straight to Britain and if necessary straight into the bank in England. The Santander Bank is where I'm going and uh, <coughs> the um, manager there to my bank here, the BNZ here, to the BNZ in England. So we've got a BNZ bank here in London and a BNZ bank here as well. So the BNZ bank was the original Awaroa Native Magistrate Court Bank in Hillenville. See? So the BNZ is connected there. They had their own two bar patented um, Palace and Town Road. And uh, we had our King Tapio from Waikato, Chief Two Bar Town Road. He went out of business because the cheeky BNZ Bank bought a printing machine and printed their town note while poor King Tapio had to buy the notes from England and the shipping cost to get the notes here. And that's where it went into recession and I'm pulling it out of recession and printing the notes with King Ernest Augustus the fifth. He's arrived in London. He's about 68, so 70, no, 72 probably now. He'll be my age just about, 75, that's who I am. And he could be 74 or, or something there. Hang on, I just got to make sure. This thing, oh, I think it's got no more space left in the mobile phone. So we'll leave that right off because it might um, fault the video put the power on so that it doesn't run out. There's no more space left in the, the mobile phone, so we'll leave that right out, and we'll just go with the laptop, and I'll see if he can save a recording for me, and I'll ask him. The video is still going on the laptop. That's 7 minutes 54. We've got two seven minutes, I think, left to go before we get invited in with um, Jamie. <coughs> Be nice to talk to him.
<coughs> okay, it's there. Oh, God. Mm. Okay, put this over here. And put that there. I wish I had an office table in proper setup because it's no good having, having half pipe. business and I've got not a good system. I got five minutes left. Five five minutes to go and we'll should be getting called in from the waiting room <coughs> on um, Jamie's Zoom meeting. We just wait around and I'll just put my mic in my hand so I can put it next to my mic because the sound will come out better on the laptop. I'll put the laptop there so I can see myself there. It's squared up enough. That's okay. That's all ready to go. And our mobile phone has got no more space in, so that's gone. So Hopefully he's going to record it for me and then I can ask him questions when he comes on. So waiting anxiously here for some good news that he will appear and then invite me in with whoever else guest he might have. Hopefully it's James K from Coinly. I hope so because um, He's very good speaker, and I can get on with him quite well. If I get on with these two guys, I will learn a lot and pass the knowledge on, because I love knowledge and information that is makes sense for what we want to do with our partnership with Britain. Here we go. Sorry, no one has responded to request to join. Hang on. Rejoin. Rejoin. Sorry, no one has responded to your to join so yes I just saw it go off so I'll go into this other one and continue to the browser and I'll go in here okay so there we are Join now. Join now. We'll see what's happening. Hey John, hold tight. Someone should admit you shortly. So I've come in and clocked in again because there might be a fault in the connection of the internet page up a bit. So I'll just make sure the connection switches off. See, it switched off on the internet connection. So the internet is still connected and still running. Um, and I'm just waiting to be invited in again. The second time, computer audio is on, background filters, Comments set up. Hey John, someone should admit you shortly. So what I'll do is I'll leave that one there. That's the third one. Then I'll go to the meeting and make another one. There, I'm opening it up again. Join. Continue on this browser there we go and we're 
are shaking that up. Hopefully. There we go. We're on there. Microsoft Teams meeting. John. And join now. Now I've joined again. Hold tight. Someone should admit you shortly. So I'm waiting for ja Jamie Nuttall to bring me in. And then I'm waiting. This is the third time i um, gone in on his page in the email and the laptop is running and I'm waiting in the waiting room and team meeting computer audio is on customize setup phone studio okay so I haven't let me in yet so it's one minute past 8 p.m. tonight and it's nine o'clock <coughs> one minute past nine in London so I've been given a invite to come on to his show to get a free consultation for the crypto accountancy for my company there and he's got the documents that um, he will be going over and to see if everything's in order and then we can go from there if I get through to him and nothing yet computer audio is on so I'm sitting waiting patiently <coughs> for him to bring me in I'm in the waiting room I'm sitting in the waiting room so I've got a spare zoom somewhere else that's the first one there and here's another one here and I'll just go into this one this is my one Zoom. I'll hear him if he comes on so I'll just carry on I'll just carry on and wait, whoops, that didn't work, and this, and this, sign in, right, I'm in again, I'm gone in on 9am, this is the one, the meeting, I'm supposed to have with him, and I'm going in on my own site 6 30 6 30 which one was it? meeting ID what's the meeting ID? I can hear him talking if he comes on where's the ID? I'm getting a little worried now because he's not there yet. Where's the ID? Um, Patterson, Jamie Nuttall. And, uh, where did I put the ID? I gotta put his ID in. Where's the ID? Hang on. ID. Where's the ID? Mm, September. Mm. Schedule? No. Mm. 
That's new booking, book, new meeting booked. <coughs> I'll go, I'll go here. Right, this, um, no, that's not it. Um, that's not it. No. Meetings? What's this meeting? No, those are my own meetings. Those are not his meetings. Those are my meetings. Where's... He hasn't answered me yet. I'm still waiting in the waiting room. So we're going to wait to see if he picks up. Hey John, hang on tight. Someone should admit you shortly. So I'm waiting to be admitted into the meeting. Um, that's it there. Location. Date, time, September the 5th, 25th, New Zealand time. Yeah, that's the one there. So that's the one. Join your team meeting. Join on the Teams app. Continue on this browser. So I'm going to, I might be doing something wrong. I don't think so because I'm used to doing Zooms, but because I'm going on to his one, it's like Andy Divine, I'll always get through on his one, there we are again, hello, hello. oh I can hear you now, are you there, I'm, I'm in the waiting room, I'll turn one off, hang on, I'll turn that one off, and I think I've got one now, I can't, I can't see you, I don't know. I'm I'm new to the Zoom um, because I've oh, never okay. I've never been a host before because I've been doing a few Zooms with Andy Devine there in for Britain, and we're I'm trying to see where you are. Or well, can you see me? All right? Can you see me? Or I'll join now. Yeah, join. Yeah, I'm I'm joining. I'm joined now. I can see myself, but I can't see you. Oh, now I, I can see, I'll turn one of these off, and I'll turn the other ones off. I've, I've had, I've, hang on, I'll turn that off, and now I've got one. Now I've got, I've got you, I can see you. Hi, how are you? Hello, good to see you again, John. Is it okay? Yeah, everything's okay. I was just getting a little worried, but I thought, oh no, I haven't done something right. So, um, Oh, I see. That's yeah. That's okay. I'm 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 very weathered with it because I've been on Zooms for quite a few years with Andy Devine straight to um, uh, Britain, or he's in uh, Greece, and he records from there. But he's an expat okay. from England, so we are together, and he's flying the flag there, and they've got the history of the flag. That's um, that's what I'm holding here for our people, and they they are depending on your knowledge how to do things properly, because Britain is where I'm going, and they're doing the crown in Wellington. The government there is going to America, so that's that direction through Australia, under Queen Victoria in Australia, set up their crown here, but. Captain Cook went to Cook Island, then went to Chatham Islands outside of New Zealand, then came that way. And that's the one I'm doing because I've got the history of that continuity of sovereignty right back through the years. So any questions from you about anything like that can come out on another day. But I'm here to listen to you and see how I can restart my company there. I never did anything that was dormant because I was in... Yes, so John, mm. I'm just going to say 
Oh, okay. That's all right. Oh, okay. Pardon? How did you hear about us? I I went looking. I I I actually found you by by who should I talk to? Someone that I feel comfortable watching all the videos. I watched every video of who is who, and that's why I ended up on you because I used to be with TagPay, which is Scarlet, in France. And I followed Scarlet all the way through to uh, Comply Advantage, uh, and I hooked up with them through Singapore to get my company going to here in New Zealand on that path. And that's what I say Scarlet has scam free. They've never ever been scammed on money transfer. They're the best in the world, the French. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah. Yes. In London, in in London, it's it's already registered, but I didn't carry on with it. So I put it, uh, uh, I I stopped it until I was ready to start up. But all the tax was up to scratch there. Everything was squared up, and so I just want to start it up again as a new company because it's got a, a billion shares off the parent company here. Okay, so why why do you think you need me in particular? I need you for your expertise on tax, um, um, crypto, because I'm new to crypto, and I've never done crypto, although I've got Bitcoin with Andy Devine, got me Bitcoin to start, kick me off, so I know a little bit, but not enough. I'm, I'm okay. out to learn. Okay, so we are an accounting firm. Yes. And although we know about crypto, we can only deal with accounts and tax. Yes, sir. Now I've already got the Bitcoin there, and uh, with the company, and I I want to see which which uh, crypto wallet to get. Um, if I want to get one with uh, um, um, James K, he sounds pretty good at setting up accounts and knows the in, ins and outs. And also Charlie um, Belling Pole, I'm in touch with him. I've got a um, um, I got him to come in on my Zoom and not yet because I want to go on his Zoom but he has to go through one of his agents to get to talk to him because he's in the um, money laundering he's on that's I'm, I'm one of those I'm, I'm one of the um, investigators of title native title to our native country the first titles yeah so that's what I do there but I'm going through the channels of Scarlet and through Singapore. Scarlet is there with Tukitaki, debt collectors and money launder people. I've, I've already in contact with them. They said, you need someone better than them. And they are the ones that had set up the, the, the Scarlet program and all the affili affiliates of it. And Panda, a bit Panda is one of them. I know a few of them in Scarlet that are affiliated to their platform which is uh, which is what I want to tie in and learn the tax at the same time but I want to make the British company work the one that I set up over here I've been since 2009 I started off when Facebook started I've got uh, enough information and experience on 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 doing my own marketing doing my own accounting doing my own Thing all the way through and the hydrogen economy which is the big tidal turbine projects that's what I've had the money for and it's gone in the wrong hands so there that's something the Scottish company I, I, I went into the competition here and I was pretty well accepted here by the big power companies to put the tidal turbine project in in in, in the sea yeah so that's part of the business project in London Yep. That uses yeah. And has yeah. Bitcoin. And where's the money go to? And I can put my uh, experience and books to say it's going on to the hydrogen project. But Eddie Mitchell and his 
uh, side of things, put it into real estate. And I wanted the money for... Sorry, sorry John, I'm very confused. Yeah. Um, so do you want to do your accounting? Yes. Or something else? Yes, okay. the accounting, yes. Accounting. Yeah, I, I can pull everything out. I can, okay. I can register it. That's fine. So, John, I, um, so you can go through me and go through my business partner. That's all right. Business, uh, That's all right. Work. Um, yep. So what I'm going to suggest is uh, I'm going to pass on my uh, yes. email address to the managing director. And yes. Or someone in the team can reach out to see exactly what we can help with that. This is why we have a quick start. Yes. Yeah, that's, 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 that's I'm good with that. So is it okay with you? Yep. Yeah, I'll do that and then someone will be in touch hopefully within the next few days. If that's, okay. that's good. That's what I want to hear. I want to hear someone okay. that can talk to me one to one and my brain is ready to go. It's it yeah, it it won't muck around with time. <laughs> it, it's very good. Yeah, that's the one, um, Jamie. That's all I want to hear from okay. you. It's been nice to well, talk to you, and, and you, puts confidence back in me and my people. They they depend on me. The, the the people depend on me a lot because I'm out there in the middle of everybody watching how I get on, and that's a good response because they can know that I'm in good hands there with people who know what they're doing. Exactly. I'll, I'll, I'll forward you on to the appropriate people within the team and hopefully can look after you and go from there. Okay, John. Thank you very much, Jamie. It's nice have to meet you. Day. And you too. You have a nice day. I'll have a nice sleep. Okay. <laughs> and uh, thank you for the meeting. My, my pleasure, mate. Take care. Okay, we'll see you again. Bye. Good job, mate. Bye. Thank you. Oh, now I could turn it off. Oh. Hey, oh, there we go, buddy. And uh, uh, Rabata, I got my meeting with Jamie. And he'll put me in touch with somebody. And we'll go from there and see how much it is going to join up with him and someone to look after our business. What? We got we got a start. We just need Charlie now and uh, to look after the things that we want to do. And uh, thank you very much people um, watching the videos and I'm talking straight to the horse's mouth or rather to the expert in crypto uh, um, law. The crypto law that's got passed, just got passed by the British Crown and believe it or not, <coughs> i just seen the two bar pound note spring up on somebody that's advertising without a name. And it's got some name there, but it goes somewhere else. And I couldn't find the video, that video in there. It's a reel. Uh, and, uh, um, and I saw the two bar pound, pound note there on, on BlackRock. And uh, I'm picking the two companies he was talking about, that pe person putting the video together, was BlackRock and Vanguard, the two biggest companies in the world, but they've got the two bar power note on the video. Okay, that's why I snapshotted it and put it on my website. I'll put the, the power note there afterwards, and then I'll put the, uh, the clip is there. Oh, I always think I already put it there, but I didn't put the power note there. I put the clip there and the brown button at the bottom, right at the bottom of the page. I'll scroll to the bottom of the page, um, Confederation Sovereigns, that page on the website, go right to the bottom and press the brown button where it says oh, something that uh, BlackRock, I've got BlackRock and Vanguard there, okay? But it's not saying who it is. That two big companies, they're not saying anything. They just got put the two bar power note in the Bank of England, you see? So they're hanging around the two bar power note and it's coming straight into the Maori, the, the Maori um, um, Magistrate King's Bench Court. Okay, the two bar pound note, and that's our Maori pound note. Okay, the Maori pound note is two bar pound note. That's the Patterson pound note, and John Patterson, they locked him up in the middle home, and locked me in the middle home too, and said there's something wrong with us. No, there's nothing wrong with him, and nothing wrong with me. It's the people that did that, the trolls that were supporting the government changing all the laws in the Queen Victoria side. It's fraud and corrupted all the way through with the one bar pounder. See, now that we've got Jamie on our side, 
I'll get Charlie um, Belling, Belling Paul, the um, director, CEO, founder of um, um, Comply Advantage, uh, money laundering, um, um, Phoenix activity, debt collector, um, and uh, he will be the next one I'll talk to. I'll try and set up the meeting. I'll put it into his email for tomorrow at 9 o'clock in the morning tomorrow. Okay, so that's with Charlie Belling Pole tomorrow at 9 a.m. London time and our time 8 p.m. again. I won't have any more morning um, uh, Zoom meetings. I'll only have um, evening ones at 8 o'clock at night here and that's 9 o'clock the beginning of a work day with uh, uh, the people I want to talk in Britain with the British crowd. Okay, I'm talking to the big crown, daddy, big daddy, over the American little daddy. Okay, that's a fake, that one there, with their money. Their money and their crypto is not good enough for Britain. Britain and their crypto law says no Bitcoin is, is obliterated off their system. They don't want to know about it because it's decentralized. It's got no government control. It's already in, as a fiat money, in their token as a grayscale Bitcoin AI trust. See, they made that fiat money, cash, and the Bitcoin as a decentralized legal law that's fraud. It's got dirt in it from the dirty fiat money to the dirty pound note. One bar. Unpatented one bar pound note of Rothschilds. They went past the Westminster Parliament, didn't go and get aired in Parliament and passed by King William the third of Orange, Dutchman. It never got the Dutch King's royal assent. Okay, so that's the problem with their money. It's fraud all the way through. One fraud equals all fraud, and that means it's all 970 million trillion trillion pound note. The greenback pound note with Ernest Augustus the fifth head on it, and he's more or less our king of our documents in Westminster Parliament. Okay, and the Bank of England of his descendant, King William III, Dutchman of Orange, and his eight-point star flag of King William IV to pick up the lease on all native lands in the world, including America and its native people, chiefs, who own that land, not the immigrants. The same with New Zealand. The immigrants do not own the land. It's the native landowners of the time. The ones that can prove where they came from with a real surname, not a bodgy made up surname and story. Thesis of professors that make things up as they go along. Just what America's doing. Making things up as they go along. The same as Cindy Kiro, Governor General here, and her parliament making things up as they go along. They say, we're going to jab you all and go and pass the law to jab you and kill you and burn you and maim you and strip you of everything of your human rights. And that's what Winston Peters did. He's a Peters, another thug pirate, that's getting the bill on his head for selling us out, this country out, with a fake, fake flag of King of Cindy Kiro. And they are swearing the oath of office to Cindy Kiro and their gazetted flag of New Zealand. That's their debtor, judgment debtor, um, default debtor, um, um, uh, criminal organisation and private company, Crown Sovereign of New Zealand. They flip that company out like they always do, like Eddie Mitchell and his 303 companies in Australia, flip my company out sideways, took 
all its instruments, legal instruments and authority and history of traditional title of Te Rawaikato Wharehiri Manukau and Rewhere for Manukau and claim the money from it that's supposed to go to me, the, um, the successor of Mohi Tamati Manukau and the Manukau chiefs from Britain direct to Westminster and that's what I'm going through now to clean all the rubbish out of our way with that flag. The flag is not a whakaputanga flag in the British Crown and the crypto and the law of England sovereign. It's our sovereign versus your sovereign in Wellington, the Maori and the Pakia. You're both in that contract with that private corporation, Crown Sovereign of New Zealand, with a fake flag of Governor-General Cindy Kiro with a crown, fake crown on her head on the flag. That's her flag and that gets the bill of 970 million trillion trillion pound note and a thousand trillion on her head and another thousand trillion on Jacinda Ardern's head and Ross Ardern's head and all those people who set up um, in that country that they went to to jab everybody when they didn't need to get jabbed, okay, and uh, and and uh, everybody else here who got jabbed. But however, that's not our problem. That's the Maori and the park here in the Parliament in Wellington, and the Maori outside. That's got a problem as well on whose land is this? Whose land does it belong to? Only the British have got the law here and franchise to all countries that were colonised but I'm putting the claim meant claim to these people I'm talking to in Britain the Crown estate business legal inheritance to all of its wealth assessed all the way back to King William the third and back to King William the first um, the William the Conqueror, 1066, Frenchman. That Frenchman to the Dutchman, King William III, to uh, King Ernest Augustus, and he's taking his ancestors' title, Ernest Augustus I, to him, Ernest Augustus V. And that's our king on our documents with his head on the 970 million trillion trillion pound note, Greenback. And that's that. It's going to be printed in the De La Rue printing company in England, the biggest um, pound note company in all, currency company in the world to print the new pound notes, the two bar on the pound note and our Bank of England. That belongs to us and me, the partner to these partners, I'm putting as the first partner, us, with the flag. We've got the Confederation flag, which is a federal government. The Maui Crown East State AI Federal Republic Government of Aotearoa New Zealand, with one of a trillion shares in the Naatua Ewa Aotearoa Limited Company, that has a trillion of uh, uh, a billion shares in each of 257 countries and I'm using the 17 trillion stolen from me with all that property in Australia of Eddie Mitchell seized of him and all his properties here seized of him against the pound note that I put on his head. Okay, he's not going to get away with it. He can't get away now that the law has been changed in England. Okay, and that's where I'm at, right in the middle of that lot. If you are meek and you are inferior law, then you can't refute this affidavit here. I'm talking to the biggest accountant in Britain, Jamie Nuttall, okay, for the Crown. And he's very precious to me because I'm going to learn from him and his person he's going to put in touch with me. I was starting to doubt it that he was going to talk to me tonight but he had problems with his internet and his zoom and we got to each other in the end so there I've got my wish come true 
and now I can end this video and say thank you very much Jamie Nuttall and of um, Minor M Y N A accounting company in London and all over the world as well and to the British Crown estate legal inheritance and I'm saying we are the Maui Crown King William the Third Trust of the 1694 Bank of England Act and ownership over the Rothschilds debtor, default debtor with the 970 million trillion trillion pound note on Black Rock's head and on Vanguard's head and on the Rothschilds and Pope Francis. He's an Argentinian fraudster and murderer of his own people and his church gets the bill. All 1.87 billion people in the Catholic Church, you all got a trillion pound on your head each. 1.87 billion trillion on your heads against your Pope. That's leading you as a thug pirate. Okay, he's milked the Admiralty of King William III and the kings that I'm a surrogate king for that no one can talk to those kings. No one can refer to those kings and not even Queen Victoria. No one has a contract with her except us. We've got a commercial corporation contract with Queen Victoria and the My Crown Queen Victoria Trust. That's up against the Grayscale Trust and their 16 other trust in their cryptocurrency in America and the IMF and the World Bank. You get this 970 million trillion trillion pound note on your head as top cap over your trillions that you think you're going to make and inflate the price and kill everybody off in America to do anything. You put the knife in the back of your own people and for all the other people that you've conquered their country illegally with our king's law. It's not your king, it's our king. Okay, because you don't have a king's flag. We've got the king's flag and the jurisdiction to try you in our court. That's anywhere in the world, in here, in this caravan, in front of everybody in the world watching this video, affidavit. You saw me and Jamie, that's an affidavit of what he's saying to me. His brain to my brain is locked in a contract with each other. We're partners. We are native partners, native of New Zealand, and he's a native of England, living man, and I'm a living man here, talking to each other in a one-on-one -on -one contract, right? He's in the court here with me. When anybody talks to me, it's a court. I'm the judge and also the prosecutor at the same time as a debt collector as well. On top of that, whichever one, whichever hat I want to put on my head on the day. Okay, an investigator or a judge or a prosecutor hat on my head or a surrogate king hat on my head. One or the other. See? Anybody got any problem with that? Come on my Zoom and if you don't tell the truth, then you get a pound note on your head, a trillion, no less, with getting it wrong. If you get it wrong, you get thrown into the High Court in London, Rolls Burley, because it's set up for any criminal fraudster on the high sea. All of you people are on the high sea. Hang on, I've got to talk. I've got to answer my phone. Hang on a second. Hang on, I'll just answer the phone. I'll turn that one off and answer this one. Hang on, I'll just have to ring it back. That's my partner in Philippines. I'll just give her a ring. Tell her I'm busy. I'll, I'll finish the video, video in a minute, and both of them, this one and that one.
I'll just try and talk through here now. Well, that video on the laptop is still going. Yep, it's still going. I'll keep that one running. And I just want to see her in the Philippines and tell her the good news I've talked to the county in Britain. He's going to put me on to somebody and that'll be very good. Hello? Hello, darling? Hello? Where are you? Oh, there you are. Hello, darling. I just got off my video with uh, with an uh, accountant in Britain. I've been on, the, I've been on, a, I'm still on a video. I'm still on a Zoom hearing on there and I've been talking to the accountant in Britain. I've been talking to the bank, uh, bank people. Then that's tonight on my, I was looking forward to that. And that to me is very important. I worked up for that all day. I prepared myself all day for that. And now it's going to happen. It's, they've got everything now. And he's putting me in touch with someone to look after me in Britain and to go after that money that Eddie Mitchell stole. Yep, it's a big job and I've got to pay their bill. See, that's what I was waiting for. The bill, when he sends me a bill for his man to set up my company there and get it going again, it's going to cost me. That's why I wanted my money and to hold on to what I've got and Pare and Rabata will help me to pay the bill for this accountant. He's, that's the top accountant in Britain, in the whole world. I've got the biggest accountant in the whole world talking to me tonight on the video. Okay, you see what I mean? I don't waste time talking to anybody who hasn't got the experience. I can't hear you. Somebody's talking and I can't hear what, what I'm saying. I'm, so, who... That's, the signal is bad, but I don't like it when somebody's talking over there and and while I'm talking and trying to concentrate on what I'm doing, and it's a big distraction to have um, her call me right in the middle of a video. That's more important than talking about someone that wants a hand and when I need a hand. So I have to wait to talk to Rabata and Pare to see what next. So I'm going to put the video up now and end the video now and then put it up so that they can get the video. Okay? So thank you very much people and we'll see you later and I'll leave the video on leave I'll, 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 I'll put leave but I'll save the video leave, hang on Leave, leave, I'll put leave, um, give feedback, rejoin, we'd love to hear your feedback on Microsoft Teams meeting, so I'll just wait a minute to see um, the recording, to save the recording and I'll turn this one off now, and that's 53 minutes 40 seconds for this video on the laptop and he was only sparing five minutes so I'm lucky to get what I got. I managed to get a little bit in of what I want his experience in accounting for my company over there. So now I'll turn this off. Where do I turn it off? There. I'll end the video now at um, 8.59 I think it is. I can't see properly. Anyway, we'll see you later. Have a nice day. Today is Wednesday, the 25th of um, September 2024. Talking to Jamie, um, Jamie Nuttall, um, um, minor from MYNA Accountants in Britain, UK. And if you want to see him on videos, it's on my website. Just scroll to the bottom and you can see him there talking <coughs> and hopefully I can save the video and put it onto my site. Where's I'm going to just rejoin the meeting and rejoin the meeting. Save. Where does it say save the video? I'll, I'll just
just turn this off. That's off 